Hello everyone, good evening. Dr. Incompetent here, and let's play some Stardew Valley, shall we? Alright. So, it is just a little past the middle of the winter, and we've got 25,000 sweet gold pieces to spend on our farm. We've upgraded all of our tools effectively to golden status. We've got a nice galaxy sword to rip into enemies wherever we like. We're collecting Omni Geodes for the trader in the desert if we wish. And I have a decision to make right now, which is what to spend my money on. There's a lot of temptation to going and buying the automated helper for my animal facilities to save some time and give me some quality of life. Hey, Bruy, good evening, my friend. How you doing? But I think what I want to do instead of that is actually purchase the upgrade to the coop so I can get ducks or the barn upgrade so I can get um, sheep. And that either one of those would allow me to make some progress at the community center. Hey, hey. Teladaga, good evening, my friend and buddy dude as well. How you doing? How's everybody doing? Oh, wow, Brewy. I love the dedication and the focus. Good luck on that 99, my friend. That sounds awesome. I'd love to see you in a spiffy new cape. But we got something in the mail. Dr. Incompetent, sorry to bother you again, but I need another favor. I got a new hammer, and I want to try it on a variety of metals. Can you smelt an iron bar and bring it to me, says Clint. Well, Clint wants an iron bar, and so we can give him that easily, right? We have um, iron bar right here that we can just go take him, right? And we... We could even make some more iron bars if we need it. I don't know that we do, but whatever. We can get some stuff in the furnace and, and going. Let's get some gold going first, though. There we go. Let me put this stuff back. Don't want to lose any of my precious materials. Okay. So the first thing I want to do is check to see what I'm going to need to make the jumbo barn. Oh, man, Teladaga, I got to tell you what. Um, I've been really meaning to play Magic the Gathering Arena. My buddies were telling me um, that there is a D&D themed set that has come out that's like based on Forgotten Realms. I love D&D, read some Forgotten Realms book when I was a, a younger man and enjoy the lore and so i thought about giving it a shot i played a little mtg arena and had a blast with it but um i'm just not sure if i want to dive in or play the physical version now that you know i can meet up with people in person as COVID is lifted hey hey cowboy how's it going my friend good to see you yeah, Bruy, I need to get into safes as well, but I gotta raise my thieving up big time to get there. Yeah, Stardew is so good. I honestly look forward to it on a Thursday night to just chill out, cowboy, and just have some fun. And I got a rusty spoon. Why not, right? There's a bubbly patch. Let's see if we can catch something good here. How about a broken CD? Alright. Let's see if we can get a good fish. You know, I, I want to check maybe if I can buy a new fishing rod, too. I'm almost there. There we go. We got a pike. Nice. Okay. Let me get to the robin as soon as I can. 
Well, Brewy, now's the time. It's free on Magic the Gathering Arena to give it a shot. Dylan, good evening. How you doing? Good to see you, my friend. I'm so glad to see, Dylan, that you picked up Hades. I hope it's treating you well amidst your other gaming endeavors. Oops, I missed uh, Robin. I gotta go a little higher to get back to her. And then I'll take Clint this bar. Mm -hmm. Alright, diving in. What is this? Oh, it's Maru. It's like a special cutscene. Oh, hello there. My dad and I are just testing some soil samples. Uh... Don't be shy. We could use a hand, actually. Whoa. Am I getting a little Maru-related... Like, date sequence? I'm not shy. Dylan, I am 100% with you. Hades is such a top quality game. The art is awesome. The gameplay is awesome. The voice acting, the story, it's just a masterpiece. I agree 100% with you. I also agree with you about Magic the Gathering Arena. I wasn't sure how it was going to turn out, but the way that the gameplay is, it's silky smooth and it's it's legit magic. It's le like the rules, everything is in play. It's so good. They did a great job with it. Could you watch this beaker for me? I'm going to grab the last batch of samples. This is me and Maru spending some quality science time together. Oh man, the baseline is ridiculous, Dylan. It's so good in Hades. I'll be right back. All right. Uh-oh. Are you leaving me alone with your father? This is awkward. Thanks for helping out, Dr. Incompetent. You're welcome, Demetrius. Mara's a good kid. She's my special little girl. I'd hate to think that anything bad could happen to her. Why, if anyone broke my heart... I don't know what element from the periodic table I'd use to end his life. If you know what I'm saying. I wouldn't want... Oh, here it comes. I knew it. I wouldn't want anything getting in the way of her bright future. Know what I mean? Look at his serious face. This is the dad to new guy in town talk. Hey, hey. Mandrake, what's up, my friend? I know, I'm getting the serious dad talk. He's just like... I could make a, a human corpse disappear just using the chemicals I have right here in my lab. Mayor Lewis would never know where to look, if you know what I mean. I know what you mean, Dad. Just some food for thought, chuckle. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Yeah, he is about to pull out his shotgun. I... I'm, I'm a successful farmer. Hey, sorry about that. I hope you found something to talk about while I was gone. Yes, we did, Maru. It was... I don't know what to say. Something special. Your dad really cares about you. <laughs> Is it hot in here? I was just telling Dr. Incompetent about the soil samples we're testing. Right, Dr. Incompetent? Actually, your dad was being weird. Say nothing. Well, we'd better try... Uh, titrate this solution before it crystallizes on us. Yeah, that's right. I'm ev exactly, Brewy. I cast a wide vocational net. I'm, I'm a good fisher. I'm great in the mines. I adventure. I kill monsters. I got second place at the uh, town festival. Um, I, I'm really coming up in the world. Okay, here, Dr. Incompetent, let me show you how to use the equipment. Thanks. Wow. 
That took 10 minutes. Nice. It seemed like a lifetime. All right. I want to um, construct farm buildings, and I want... Oh, you can make another shipping bin. That's nice. Okay. I want a deluxe barn, I think, so I can get sheep and pigs. That sounds great. I've got the 25,000, but I need 550 wood and 300 stone. Let's see if I have that. Let me just head back to the house and run a check on my inventory. So this is a dumb Stardew Valley question, but Demetrius and Robin, they're together, they're married, and Maru is their child? Or is that not how it works? Yeah, truffles. Now, there you go. Okay, I need some more wood. I have enough um, stone, so I just need to get my formidable golden axe out and chop up some wood. No problem. Oh, let's get these worms. It's a rusty spur. All right, come on, lumber. Man, I've really done a number on the trees in the area. Kind of feel bad about that. Oop, more worms. Bam. A warp totem. Nice. Another rusty spur. There's Neo the dog. Hello, Neo. Let's get you some water. All right, here we go. Maru is Demetrius and Robin's daughter. Thank you for clearing that up. Oh, so Se Sebastian is also Robin's son, but he's kind of like the, the the family black sheep. He doesn't get along with everybody else. Interesting. Well, Stardew Valley is never short of drama, is it? You know what, Bruy? I think that's a great point. I should probably stop chopping the wood at my own farm. I mean, I, I do want to clear space. That seems wise. But at the same time, I don't want to deforest the place. Oops, wrong thing to do. I was just trying to check on how much wood I had. All right, here we go. How much wood do I have? I got enough. All right, we're going for it. I'm going to go put down the down payment. Oh, I got to talk to my animals, but I'll do that when I get back. Let me just make... I'm going to lock this in. I don't want to mess this up. Does Sebastian live with them as well? Or does he live by himself? I'll, I'll take a look for myself. Yeah, this, this place is huge. She's clearly been upgrading her own... Um, farmhouse. Select a big barn to upgrade. This one. She's coming. Okay, I'll start working on your barn upgrade first thing tomorrow morning. I mean, they should support me courting Maru just in terms of how much financially I've done for their family by purchasing these expensive upgrades. You also want a grove for collecting tree products. Dylan, that's a great idea. Let's get ourselves a grove. You know, I have to say personally, I've always wanted a grove of my own in reality. And when you can't make that happen, you just build your digital grove. Clay. Oh, there's a new choice on the board. Let me look at this. Prismatic Jelly or Robin's Resource Rush. She wants a thousand pieces of stone in a week. And they'll earn a reward and they can keep the stone. Oh, let's do that all day. That sounds fun. I know, Bruy. That would be a perfect place to read. Yes, I'm just going to retire to my grove for a little reading 
What's up, dude? I got your iron bar that you were clamoring about. Um, here. Hey, it's the iron bar I asked for. It looks strong. Perfect. Thanks, Dr. Incompetent. I appreciate this. Dude, you're welcome. Alright, I'm going to keep my Omni Geodes. What do I get for doing this? Um, 500 gold. That really helps me out of a tight jam I was in there, Clint. I had lost all my money to Robin. Alright, I'm going to go back to the bus stop and go home. You know, the quarry would be a great place for me to go and just pick up that stone. She didn't say that it had to be at my own place. Alright, let's just... Oh god, I'm, I'm planting trees everywhere and I don't mean to be. Give me these. Alright. Let me help my animals. Hello. Sorry, everybody. I'm a little late today. Oh, I have the grass on me, don't I? Or I did. What happened to all my grass? Did I put it away? Oh, my sweet God. Corey with a couple of bombs? That's perfect. Brewie, let's do that. Oh, my God. Where's all my grass? What has happened? Oh, shoo. Here it is. I was like, my animals are dead. They're all going to die. No, they're okay. Make a little mayonnaise. wonder what the chickens would think if I fed them mayonnaise. This is great. Where'd you get it? Don't ask. Alright, there's food for everybody. Let me get my bucket out. Okay. Hello. Hi. I'm mastering the combo. The say hello and milk at the same time. All right, all right. <laughs> you just fry them eggs, Bruy. Oh, my God. What a sick... What a sick world we live in. I hard boil them. Well, here's a bunch of uh, rocks, anyway. So I know I can make bombs. Maybe I should um, check what the recipe is for doing that. Let's see. What's it? What's it take... Just to make explosives, huh? If I wanted to make, like, just a regular bomb, I just need iron ore and coal. Oh, I can do that all day. Hey, it's... I am kid-friendly, my friend. All kid-friendly all the time. How you doing? Neo, good evening. Oh... Yes, thank you, Neo, for vouching. That's so funny. I know, I hate that. Um, hey, it's thanks so much, my friend. I love Ariel. I'm a huge Ariel fan. Put these spurs away. Um, let me actually just add to existing stacks. And then what I want to do is just take out... Iron ore and coal. Like this. And then let's just make some bombs. Let's just get get crazy with bombs. I do have this. I can put some stuff away in here. I'm going to store the rest of my um, wood and stone so I don't lose it in case I accidentally bite the dust. I'm going to put my gold bars away in here. And you can take my iron bars, too, for that matter. I'm going to put this really nice pasta in there. And then I'm going to work on the crafting. And we're going to make bombs.
There we go. I got 15 bombs. That should really make an impression at the quarry. Broken CD, pike, crocus. Get in there. There we go. All right, I'm going to take the uh, little train over. Aztec Gamer, what's up, my friend? Good to see you. I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. How are you doing? All right, we're going to go to the quarry. And we're going to just blow this up like Brewery suggested. You know, this will actually let me get to the bottom of an experiment I was curious about, which is... Do bombs take care of worms? Probably not, but it would be funny. Wow, look at all the stone. That is great, Aztec Gamer. I have a quest from Robin to see if I can gather 1,000 stone in a week, and I'm trying it out. Well, maybe it did clear away those worms. Thank you, It's Ariel. I appreciate that, my friend. I hope you're doing well. I'm just doing some nighttime bombing. I bet the people in the town are like, um, someone is making explosions at the quarry, and it's 9 p.m. I've got a long day at work tomorrow. Can someone tell this guy? Sorry. Hey, G, what's up, my friend? How you doing? You know, I think I can just keep pro progress on it right here. I got 174 today, but that really wasn't my best attempt. I wonder what the best floor would be for just all-out rock, you know? Like, let me just go to 20 and see what it... No, that's not good. Okay, here's a bunch of stone. How's everyone doing? It's a bomb. Man, you guys did actually way better against that than I thought. All right, cool. And I might want to go a little bit deeper. I guess an idea I could have here would be... Oh, I hit myself with my own bomb. That's funny. Oh, absolutely, Aztec Gamer. You sure can. Yeah, I think it must have Brewy, but I'm not 100% sure on that. It felt like it did. I should be getting um, iron chunks so that I can just make more bombs. And make this whole progress, this whole process even, even sweeter. Oh, you can't take out these big boy rocks, though. There we go. There's an iron ore chunk that I can just flip over into a bomb. Oh, awesome, Aztec Gamer. Yeah, it's such a good game, isn't it? It's fantastic. Oh my god, wrong thing. Alright, let's get all these guys out of the way. One more bomb and I'm going back to base. Although the quarry seems to be the most efficient. Alright, leave the mine. Let's just hop in our little cart here. Oh my god, I put down a bomb. I blew up the cart. Why? What's wrong with me? Alright, I wasted a bomb. That's embarrassing. Don't tell Pam what I've done. Hey, Nurse Incompetent. Good evening. How you doing? Planet Zoo is going great. I got my new zoo like we talked about in Japan, and it's doing it. Oh, thank you, Azrael. No worries. Raids come and raids go. G, 
just like the seasons in Stardew Valley. Actually, let me sell all this stuff and get some money back. I'm low on cash. Hey, Ariel, thanks for the follow, my friend. And, yeah, that looks good. That looks good. And we're going to sleep. Did you see Nurse Incompetent? Did you see episode one? It's already up there. That's right, Neo. Man, I need a bumper sticker that says that. The incompetency is eternal. The only constant is incompetence. Dear Dr. Incompetent, I would like to give you some information about an upcoming event, the Feast of the Winter Star. It's a time for the community to come together and think back on all the good fortune we've had this year. We have had a lot of good fortune, haven't we? It's good to be grateful. A favorite tradition is the secret gift exchange, where everyone in town is randomly assigned to someone else. On the day of the festival, everyone brings a gift for their secret friend and surprise them with something special. This year, your secret friend is Clint. Don't tell anyone. The feast will take place on the 25th from 10 to 2 at the town square. See you then. All right, cool. We got to get Clint a secret gift. It will definitely be mayonnaise. Thank you, Ariel. I appreciate that, my friend. Yeah, Nurse Incompetent, it is up. Episode 1 of the new Planet Zoo. Zoo is already up, my friend. Take it. Check it out. It's one hour of pure Planet Zoo goodness. I would love uh, your advice. That's right, Secret Santa indeed. I, I wonder if I should just give him, like, some metal, because he loves metal. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, Mandrake. I mean, I know what Clint likes. The man's the blacksmith. This guy just wants to work with metal. Now, I'm going to be honest, though. Who doesn't like a gold bar? Like, a gold bar is kind of on my Christmas list every year. Now, granted, I've been disappointed and not received it each year, but it's still, you know, something I shoot for. I, I've become such a lazy farmer with my bombs for these rocks. Hey, hey, Brewie. The uh, latency a little better on Twitch. Oh, snow yam. All right, so let's get back to the fun. I'm going to craft a couple more bombs and head over to the quarry. There we go. I can also make cherry bomb, which makes a smaller explosion, but we haven't. It's still a bomb. A bomb is a bomb is a bomb. Hey, hey gee, nice, my friend. Good progress. Yeah, Neo, I don't know. Like, I, I... I wish I could say reliably which one ran better and understand why that's the case. But I don't know. Oh, I forgot to milk my cows. I'm a bad cow owner. Robin was in here, like, working on the barn... And she's probably looking at me like, that idiot forgot to even milk his cows. Why am I bothering to upgrade his his barn? He doesn't even know how to be a real farmer. He's never going to be good enough for my daughter. Nah, she's too nice to say something like that, isn't she? She's rooting for me. Hey, hey. Aurora, what's up? Yep, 
Yeah, Leia is a good one. You know, you can't really go wrong. I mean, you could make a, a strong case that Pam is wrong, but I don't know. Maybe, she, maybe I'm just not looking at her the right way. You know what, G? It was actually rainy where I'm at, too, today. It's such a great way to spend a rainy day, just chilling and watching some YouTube. Speaking of Pam, no, no, we've said nothing bad about you, Pam. You're an amazing bus driver. Yeah, you're right. She is holding down a job now. Oh, the quarry doesn't respond instantly. Good to know. Maybe it takes a little bit more time for those rocks to come back. All right, I'm going to pick a different depth this time. I'm going to go down to like 40 to try to get iron. I don't want it to be too hard. Yeah, here's iron all over the place. This is great. Blowing it up. Are you crazy? Yes, I am. Man, look at that. That's some good work on that. There we go. <laughs> oh, that's cool, Aurora. Yeah, no, it's great. That's that's one of the things I got to get better at my AFK game with RuneScape. I will one of these days, but I love that, um, I think one of the reasons my player-owned farm is such a focus in RuneScape is because I love just farming games like this. I keep waiting for the day when they do some kind of Harvest Moon or something that's in, like, absolutely sick graphics, you know, but somehow still keeps the spirit of the game. I haven't seen it yet, but I'll be excited when it comes out. I do like hitting myself with my own bombs. It's funny. This guy's crazy. Yeah. Yeah, he is. <laughs> Alright, Ariel. Thank you so much. Take care, my friend. You have a good night, too. I got my gold pick. Let's get him. There we go. Ten stones is pretty good. Let me check the progress. Alright, so... We're on pace right now for Robin's resource rush. And the cool thing about this is that you get to keep the stone. The way I figure it, I'm gonna need the stone anyway. So, might as well. Ooh, I got a coffee bean. Might as... Don't mind if I do, you know? Um, let me craft some more bombs. And start using them. Look at all that copper. Man, with this pick, I am so good at breaking up these big boulders that it's not that it's not that bad to get the stone, honestly. Now that is a lot of people, Ariel. You have to you have to figure out where the merchant is, Brewy. I feel you. Sometimes you cannot pay attention in RuneScape, and then sometimes you die. All right, we're going down. Oh, I see a spot for a bomb. God, the, the music down here in the mines is just 
next level stuff. I'm gonna have a bunch of geodes for Clint. There we go. Thank you so much, Ariel. Oh boy. Oh boy, it's coming at me. Alright, let's use the old cherry bombs. Mm -hmm. I think some tactful cherry bombs should take care of this section nicely. Alright, beautiful. I'm like one of those fishermen that fishes with dynamite. And it feels really good. Mmm. Oh, nice, Neo. I love how you guys all have plans for these things. These different ways to... Do things in RuneScape. I have so much to learn. All right, we did an okay job. Let's go down again. Get out of here, Bat. All right. Not very much metal, unfortunately. I think the most iron is around floor 40, and so maybe I should have just stuck to that spot. Can I make any more bombs? Uh, just some cherries. Well, better than nothing. Here we go. <laughs> you know what, Mandrake? It is. It's contagious like that. It's my XCOM bleeding over into Stardew Valley. Hunting wall. Good evening, my friend. That is a big number that you just referenced there. Whenever the exponent has more than one digit, you're talking about insanity. Uh, of a number that's so big that I can't even fathom it. All right, Dylan. So good to see you, my friend. I hope you have a delicious meal with the family. Good luck on Hades. I hope you can uh, beat it. I think it it took me 20 attempts, maybe 25 attempts, before my first victory. It's It gets easier, but it's, it's still tough. You know what, Neil? I mean, I've honestly... I didn't understand that philosophy of why people would ever do that until I started doing some of the stuff myself. Um, and I was like, you know what? If I'm going to, like... grow fruit trees or work on my gardens at each of the different allotment patches, I'm going to need to optimize my entire strategy for this. So much of what I find with that game is that it's like um, managing my tiny inventory. Well, that's great, G. Then that means you're uh, you're getting a chance to see some some new games and hopefully find some ones that you enjoy. 